So I'm going to take a few minutes to show you how to get rid of blemishes in the skin of your images. Um, this is just a raw file here. I haven't done anything to it. Um, but what I'm going to do is create a new layer above my image, and you can name it if you want. And then I come over here to select my Spot Healing Brush tool. I choose Lighten, Proximity Match, Sample All Layers. And then I'm just going to come under here and pick, um, make sure my, my brush is a little bit softer, and I make sure that it's small. So when I zoom in, I can now take that brush, click on that, and kind of just kind of like stroke away from it. Small strokes work best, okay? So you just want to keep doing that in small little strokes until you're happy. And you would do this to the entire face. So I'm going to do this to this entire face, and I'll show you what it looks like when I'm done. So once you've done that for the majority of the face, you can now run a, um, a softening action on the skin just to kind of smooth it a little bit. Um, because, you know, it, I, I just feel like the two work well together. Um, I'm using, I believe this one might be Michelle Kane's. Um, I do it at a lower opacity so it's not too, you know, too smooth because I don't want it to look plastic. Um, and you can use, I mean, I think everybody has a skin softening action nowadays, so use whoever you, you have in your file um, to just kind of soften that out a little bit. Um, my goal is not to make people look fake, it's really just to, to just clean it up a little bit. Um, you know, already this client would be very happy, I'm sure, um, seeing that her skin is now a whole lot better. If I clicked on history and showed you the original, you know, there's a lot of blemishes there. Um, as opposed to what we're seeing now. So again, it's all about just getting it perfect uh, for that reason. All right, so this is where we'll just go ahead and finish editing and I'll show you a final image when I'm done. All right, so I'm all done editing the picture. Um, I have popped the colors a little bit, warmed up um, the image some, and um, yeah, just kind of enhanced it a little bit more. If you saw the original again before blemishes were all done, this is what it looks like. And then the final output is this. All right, so I hope that helps you with your blemish cleaning skills. Thanks.